what is going on you beautiful human being welcome back to my channel today we're reacting to free room beyond journeys and episode 14 called privilege of the young should be really interesting if you like free room beyond journeys and smash that like button consider subscribing to my anime reaction videos and hit the notification bell so that you stay up to date let's just jump straight into it let's go so yes they had i actually can't even remember his name but they've got the new guy who joined them what was his name now i really can't actually remember it's funny like in the show privilege of the young so what i was saying is that when it comes to the shopping whenever they reach a town there's always like something to it you know freedom either has like a memory or it's like it was uh, stark's birthday the one time or freedom was trying to look to get a gift for finn you know there's always something going on it's not just like going out oh and she got him a gift the last time <laughs> holding her breath oh my gosh it's kind of interesting because they aren't together right stark and fern are, are not together but it's very much like they have that relationship oh that's the bracelet that she got him so it's been a year since freerun got her that hair on ornament <laughs> did you choose one with him i still i don't know why i can't remember this guy's name but let me try think a little bit i really can't think of this guy's name right now very true people won't know how you feel unless you tell them it's like i used to be like that a lot where it's like you'll be angry or frustrated or sad or upset and then it's like you want them to smell that you like you're feeling off you know it's like just use your words i wanted to choose a gift with you Why did I think for a second they were going to hold hands? <laughs> what is Freedom doing on the roof? <laughs> Sign. That's his name. Freedom is one of the funniest characters ever. Those arguments of privilege of the young. Looking after two kids, but really, you know, they looked after her. Hater, obviously. <laughs> the corrupt priest. <laughs> you're even more depraved but gambling tobacco alcohol the first time he matured is when he was like 70 years old That's what the goddess is for. The concept is still so... It's going to be interesting to see how it, like, unfolds, you know. Like, what is the... Because I know for a fact there's something bigger that's going on. And not just as it seems. You know, even going to heaven and speaking to the goddess and stuff like i know for a fact there's like an underlying background to everything 
<laughs> few women are older than me because he sees her as like the kid so this is the banda woods located in the northern land <laughs> That's gonna be her birthday gift, maybe. Oh, remember she took out the ring like the last time? Who was it for? Was it for stock? Oh. Oh my gosh, avian monsters. Oh my gosh, this just flips everything on its head. Forty years since the humankind learned to fly. Stalk and jump to his technique. Like. <laughs> but then again, Aizen is a dwarf, though. <laughs> That's the second time they say that. Haito was appalled, and then Fern says, it just goes to show he wasn't a normal person. Let's go free run. Oh my gosh. Takes the head off clean. I wonder what spell she used. Oh my gosh. Only the horse is flying. <laughs> you call that a plan? <laughs> Take a while, and that would be a couple of days, maybe even like a week or two. But what I was saying before that crazy thing happened was that she wanted to give that ring to Stock, and then she saw the recipe for the... What was it called again? The warrior steak, I think it was. That type is the hardest to deal with. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't think you knew what you were doing. <laughs> the Murd Lotus. Oh, wow. I didn't know. <laughs> I've been saying it the whole time. Star can not win. A wild boar. <laughs> I wonder how long that took because they like would will stay in places for like six months even like we saw when they were in the cabin there with Croft oh because she can't find the ring <laughs> That's why Himmel obviously gave it. Oh, a spell for finding lost things. Wow.
I swear it's so similar between Freerun and Fern, Himmel and Stark. Oh, so he knew what it was. Wow. On the on the wedding finger, engagement finger, ring finger. So are you are they saying that Freerun and Himmel actually got married or engaged? Cuz I mean there's a lot we actually don't know. Wow, really interesting episode. And like like we know, Freerun Beyond Journey's End is just, you know, it's a very chill show up until something big happens. Like, you see, like right in that moment, I kind of like I was lulled to sleep. Not to sleep, but you know, I was just I was just observing the show and I was thinking about when she was actually looking for the ring to give it to Mr. Stark, uh, Mr. Stark. To give it to Stark as uh, as a gift. And then she ended up like getting the the warrior stake, I think it was called. So that's why, how come I knew that was the ring that she was talking about. Obviously, we know that it it's means for eternal love. So it's interesting to see that Himmel gave it to Freerun, and then there was that scene of him putting it on her ring finger, you know, and you heard the bells as well. So I don't know what happened there. Maybe we'll find out later. Because I mean, it's not impossible that they even got married or something. You know, like maybe the tradition it wasn't as big to free run as before, because as you know, things just kind of slip past her. But it could easily have been the case that they were married before. Uh, what else we saw was that you know, sign is with them now, but the whole episode really just revolved around being young. You know, that's what the episode is called, if I can remember something about being young. But that's what we see, and that's the kind of thing with the show, is that they can do a whole episode on themes. It doesn't have to really be anything specific, other than the journey. And I, that's actually something interesting that I just said about each episode having its own theme. Even the last episode, like, aversion to one's own, and we saw what happened with that. And they can't, and that's the theme of the, of the, of the episode, really. And now we're seeing something about being young and how sign was sort of overlooking it and that's the type of thing you're gonna get with free run they're moving on now they got to the bunda woods they're moving to the next town with this new merchant who gave her that spell which is pretty awesome how you know the light sort of just came out of the forest where the ring actually was but they're making their way through they're making their way through to end um, and i which i know for a fact just after seeing everything before with the demons that ender itself is it's really going to take the show to the next level but other than that i just there's something about the show that i can just relax and i say it every week but on a friday i can just kind of relax and just enjoy the show like you don't it's just one of those beautifully done shows might not even be for everybody i didn't think it was for me to begin with but i've really grown to like it but anyways that's going to be it for me if you like freedom beyond journeys and smash the like button consider subscribing to my anime reaction videos and hit the notification bell so that you stay up to date because i'm releasing episodes every day of the week mental but that's going to be it for me i'll leave the last episode right up over here thanks for watching if you're watching i'm out peace in a bit